Hello everyone, it's Misla from Dual Core Studio and today we begin with mini series how to draw 32 by 32 pixel art characters. This mini series will consist of few different videos and in each video I will make a template which you can download from our website. I will link that in the description. So you can download this, tem this template and every other template on your PC and you can work with me. Also, for each character, for each different style, I will show you an example how you can create your own characters. So you can make basically anything you want to, okay? So if you haven't watched my previous videos, how to draw 8 by 8 pixel or 16 by 16 pixels our characters, you can watch them if you want to. I'm gonna link those in the description as well. Okay, so before we start, I wish to explain just a few things. Uh, these colors, which you can see, uh, each represents one part of the body. Black color, of course, represents feet. Um, this lighter shade of gray represents his arms and his legs, or her in other cases. And this darker shade of gray basically means torso. Of course, the skin shade will represent, of course, skin, fists, or anything else. And this black color represents his hair or her hair. Okay, so now that we have that covered, you can watch on this, this part of the screen, you can watch the preview. And I'm gonna draw them in the middle. Now, before I begin, I'm just gonna make a background. Okay, maybe even lighter. Yeah, much better. Okay, so time to begin. Now, let's, I'm gonna try to cover both modern and medieval, maybe even ancient styles, uh, basically making a modern human and maybe, I don't know, a knight, magician, ranger, I don't care, something. Let's just go with the flow. So, first one, well, let's go with a knight. Now, I'm going to try to keep this as simple as possible. Just, just to show you a few examples. This will be a chainmail. Of course, you can do anything you want to, but let's try to keep everything as simple as possible. As I said, you can watch everything here. I'm gonna, I'm, I pretty much use a lot zoom in and zoom out so I can uh, quickly see how each pixel behaves. But if, I mean, someone can get a headache when he watches my videos, so you can watch it over here. Okay, so maybe even lighter tone for his legs and arms and just let's give a simple sword whoop stray pixels okay pretty simple isn't it now of course you can add shield you can work on details maybe even add a cloak or a cape i mean Possibilities are endless. Okay, so on to the next one. Um, let's make this one a magician, maybe. Maybe fire magician. Now, of course, as you, as there's something you can uh, notice is that I can add a few pixels, or I simply can, or I can simply use this template and just color in the body, and that's all. Uh, okay, so as I said, a magician, this can be his cape, and let's say it goes a, just a little bit away from his body, like so. Okay, 
now let's make a few different things. Maybe give him a belt. Okay. Of course, when you're dealing with uh, clothes, uh, clothes like this, uh, it's really good to give a shade tone around his head so at least you have some volume again we can add shadow on this side maybe on like this like so now even if you want to now in this specific template as you can see you cannot see his left arm you can see only a part of the fist but in this case i'm just gonna rotate this part so it looks like his arm even though i mean if you take this part and put it over here you can see that we basically took one part of the template that wasn't arm we made an arm from that so you can add or you can remove pixels as you feel like it do not feel by any means restricted to experiment okay now as he is fire magician i am gonna add just few details and let's say he holds a little fireball in his arm Okay, and in this case, I mean, um, usually a source of light uh, drops light on your character. So as you can see, since light source is coming from this uh, fire, it drops light on your character. Okay, so that's a quick magician, fire magician. Now, if you want to make something modern and something simple, um, you can do, I mean, really simple stuff like, if, I mean, in both of these cases, I added some pixels, but if you don't want to, you can simply color in this template, like so. Let's say blue jeans and Somewhat yellowish, orangish. Like a sweater or maybe even we can give him shorter sleeves. See? Really simple. Now, if you want to give him, give him a different haircut, you can do so. You can... Uh, even change the color of his hair to, I don't know, maybe something like this. Okay. And for the last example, let's make from this, let's make, uh, so what do we have here? We have a knight, we have a fire mage, we have normal modern human and let's make a soldier modern soldier uh, with a camouflage maybe on a bit darker yeah much better and just to give him something to differentiate
let's try with a bit different color okay So something like a camouflage. And there we go, we have a soldier. Now of course, I mean you can even make a zombie from all of this. Just change his skin color. Maybe even to... You can change his race if you want to, I mean skin color. Yeah, so that's pretty much it, let's uh, leave it like this. Let's say his entire body is in some sort of a, a war color for camouflage. Now as you can see, uh, all of these characters are just slightly different. Uh, really not much, F let's say first and second, you can see his feet are a bit different and his pose. If you take third one, uh, I mean also his legs, when you take third one, he's pretty much the same as uh, first one except again feet, his arms and even his head is a bit thicker, his neck. And the last one he is a bit buffier, but it's all the same, I mean... Uh, the styles are re really similar, but you can achieve different effects with each and every one of them. Of course, um, you can do whatever you want to, so please do experiment. Now, if we go to female ca characters, okay, so we have. What do we have? Okay, so let's try to make, since you all already have green color, uh, let's try to make like a ranger. Uh, now then again, if if you don't know how to make your own color palettes, now I'm pretty much doing this everything on the go. But if you wish to know how to make color palettes, I probably will make that video as well in the future. Maybe different color. Okay, so really simplistic ranger, of course. I can work on details even longer, but I like to keep my videos as short as possible. But you can add like a bulb, you can even add a few more colors and so on. Uh, now let's say you want to make a, maybe a modern woman. So I'm going to show you how to change few proportions actually. So let's try something like this. Mm 
now something like huge huge shoes we can leave them like this okay so next one now let's say let's change her color first let's say you want to make her hair longer you can do so easily you just add a few pixels and that's all really simple isn't it so now then again one thing i wish to say is that if for example you have same skin tone for her belly and her arms in this case you really can't see this part of her arm so well but when you animate her when you animate this character when she moves uh, this arm will move as well and so you will know it's there so not everything needs to be in different colors okay if you want to make her proportions a little bit bigger you can do so I mean it's pretty much all up to you but even I mean you can even even make her like uh, have her flatter chest or even bigger it doesn't really matter it's all up to you okay now this looks a bit strange okay so yeah okay so let's move on uh, if you wish to make something uh, nicer more elegant Let's make like a address. Okay. So this is another example. Let's make her hair a bit lighter. A bit longer. Okay, and for the last example, let's make, I don't know, maybe an old lady, perhaps. So something of a grayish color. Maybe like so and maybe something like this well okay um, so again I hope this helped you uh, of course I, I will repeat one more time you can find these templates on our website and I will link that in the description so please uh, if you wish to practice this style please do but of course if there is any style whatsoever from any game you wish to learn how to draw please let me know down in the comments so please write in comments what game do you like the most what pixel art style do you like the most and which one you would like to learn and I will basically try to research that style and try to replicate it as best as possible again this 32 by 32 pixel art characters is mini series and I will make few videos about this okay so I hope this helped you don't forget to like this video if you liked it share it with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe until next time see you later